So, I know that it's one of those things that's sort of a mystery to everybody how we look so fabulous all the time. So I thought that I would give you some makeup tutorials. I'm Titania Lynn and this is Sarah Liz. Hi. Today I'm going to teach you how to create the perfect blowjob lip, right? Okay, I know, this is so exciting. I've always wanted that. So, the key to a good blowjob lip is making your lips look bigger than they actually are. See, Sarah's got some shit on her face already, so I'm going to wipe that off just a second. Okay. Stop. Okay. So this is about me. Shh. Sorry, sorry. So first we're going to just, like, wipe this crap off of her face. I don't know what color this is. It's, like, pink-ish, but there's not enough. You see that, like, I don't know what's going on. She's getting a little red around the edges, so I'm just going to, like, put some shit on her face and, like, fix her up. Like, much better. Now, the key is to... See this? Duck lip? Duck lip? Not good. Mm-mm. Okay. Relax your face. Have them relax. Have them think about something peaceful and calming, like their power animal or whatever. Okay. So first I draw this point right here. It's called your Cupid's bow. I don't really know why because it doesn't look like a little fat baby with wings, but you know, some people are crazy. So you draw that and so you can kind of get an idea of where your lips are. Because sometimes your lips are really super pale. And that is not going to get anybody to want you to suck their dick if you have pale lips. So that's why we're going to something really bold. Something that says, hey, I'm here. Are you looking at my mouth or what? That top lip isn't big enough. So we're going to go a little bit around. Like, just make another line. Like, you're outlining the outline. Yeah. Like, when you used to pretend, like, your bubble letters that you made in school had, like, a shadow. Imagine that, but yeah, I remember those. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, but all around the lips. Okay, relax. I don't know what Sarah's thinking about here, but I think that it's a place that I probably don't want to go. <laughs> oh yes, you do. Oh, do I? <laughs> okay, that's enough. Enough laughing. All right. You really want to like make yourself stand out. You want to be original because nobody wants to be told that they look like somebody else. So make yourself look really unique because I don't look like Natalie Portman. Natalie Portman's already famous. I want to look like her. I want to be famous on my own. So, because I'm a unique little flower. Anyway, so go with something unique. Don't look like anybody else. So Sarah looks a little bit too much like Angelina Jolie if you cut off the top of her head and you just look at her lips. So I'm going to make her lips look a little different than Angelina's. Though Angelina's hot as hell. Yeah, she is. And she's mm. brown. Mm. But we don't we don't want to look like her exactly. We want to look kind of like her so people go, wow, I can't afford an Angelina Jolie for my movie, but I can afford to Tanya Lynn or Sarah Liz or whatever because you never know when you're going to see people that are important. So we just line this and scribble a bit, you know, just get it on. Sometimes you can just go out like this. I mean, if you're one of those people that smears their lipstick all over their face all the time, I mean, I do sometimes when I'm drinking coffee and I'm just like, oh, it's so funny, and I, so you could just go with liner if you like that look. Right now we want, we want guys to be like, that's the girl I want home to make. So we're going to take like a really dark, rich color. You see this? See this color? See how dark it is? This is a really good color. See? See, it's a really good color. It's really dark. Lip gloss all over her lips. God, what were you eating today, Sarah? I had a sucker. Oh. It was really big. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Sarah hasn't learned exactly how to diet yet. <laughs> she keeps eating suckers. I just like to suck on things. Good! That's the object of this tutorial. And you want to, every once in a while, make this face. Because that's what you're going to be doing. So you want to make sure it looks really good, which means you got to get up into the corners because they're going to see that. See, now the whole time I'm doing this, Sarah's practicing. She's thinking about what she's going to be doing later. Uh huh. Because you never know who you're going to have to suck up to. Ah! Okay, so now you see I've got this really good color here. Oh, yeah, that looks good. Yeah, that's exactly what we need. But you really want to make it pop. You want to make it, like, she's got big lips. Let's make them look bigger. So then I'm going to take this light color, and I'm going to dab it right here, right along where, like, the light hits. So if you look at yourself in the mirror, you kind of see a reflection where it's lighter. You want to make it even lighter. It makes you look like your lips are even bigger. Okay, now if you really, 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 really want to make your lips look even bigger, which you do, you want to take and do like, 
like take a dark color like this is a really good dark color and you just kind of want to end at the bottom and a little bit right here like right in the corners to sort of shade it this is like you're trying to make your lips even more 3d than they are so you know look see how good that looks yeah yeah those those are lips that could give a great hummer any day so thanks for listening remember i used this stuff oh, oh this stuff here to make these awesome blowjob lips. Bye!